Good morning everyone and welcome to another vlog. Today we are flying from Coron to Cebu and we are at the smallest airport we've Fran been so far. Yeah, Francisco de Reyes Airport. Yeah. <laughs> Super cute. We don't know what kind of plane we are boarding, but we have the feeling that it's one uh, very, very small. So this is going to be interesting. Good morning. Good morning. Good afternoon for the information of the Wiki family. Sarko flight TV 6043 from Manila. It's time to have some lunch, actually. Pretty cool. In uh, the airport. Because what? Um, Around 5 euros. 5 euros. So, not that expensive. And at least we have a meal that is not cake and uh, sweets and whatever. Normally when we travel, it's always like that. Today we are going for a normal lunch. Hmm. What do you think for airport food? Actually, it's very good. Nice. Yeah. Let's enjoy it. What's not fancy is this rain. Dirty, dirty rain. Every time we travel. <laughs> Every single time. <laughs> wow. The trolleys are already in place for you to take your luggage. Good morning everyone, we are in the city of Cebu, which is the second largest city in the Philippines. We have 24 hours to explore the city, so let's make the most out of it. We are in the Colon Street and this is the oldest street in the whole Philippines. If you want to buy stuff, this is the place for you. This is super chaotic today because it's Saturday and as you can imagine, everyone wants to go shopping and uh, that's what we are experiencing right now. This street is very impressive, there's shops of everything that you can imagine and possibly want it's just people everywhere shops everywhere cars everywhere cars everywhere it's, everything everywhere at least it's crazy yeah. we're loving it <laughs> at least you can find anything that you need you can find it here there's no doubt about it 
and uh, yeah, we are trying to find a good place to have some coffee. So let's get going. Quick stop to grab a coffee. Iced coffee this time because it's so very hot. It's good. Is it good? Yeah. What are you gonna eat? A super small croissant. A bit better. <laughs> very close to the Column Street, there's this market. It's a very traditional market with uh, the normal food stands and fruit stands and uh, a lot of things here. And you you find lots of um, locals eating here at lunch hour. So now it's lunch hour. We are trying to find a restaurant for us to eat, and you, we just stumble upon this little market where everyone is eating. Everyone that is lo local is eating here. Hello. Everyone is so nice here. sir. Oh, how much? Two twenty, two hundred. Two hundred. Yes. Black. We have black. Other design. I like this one better. Ah, you like it? Yeah, I like this one. Yeah, I'm gonna take this one. Only one, sir? Yeah, just one. Just this one. Pedro bought a t-shirt for 200 pesos. He loves one piece, so... No, no, it's okay. Just the, the shirt. For now, it's just the shirt. How about you, mom? No, I'm okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, mom. One piece shirt, let's go. We are now at Plaza Independencia and this is where you can find the Fort San Pedro and that's exactly what we are going to visit right now. Uh, let's hope that we still have some money left over to enter because I think you have to pay 30 pesos per person to enter and I think that's exactly what we have. Another thing is that we need to be quick about it because there's a lot of uh, dark clouds coming this way and I think it's going to rain pretty heavily in the meantime. So let's get going. Our plan was to visit Forte San Pedro but uh, it's closed. It's a holiday today here in the Philippines and they have an event over there. I think it's a wedding. Not, not really sure about the event that is going on. So unfortunately, we cannot go in. Well, at least the plaza surrounding the Fort San Pedro is very beautiful, so we can um, spend a little bit more time here and enjoy the, the green, because it uh, has some trees and some um, gardens. It's cool, isn't it? It's very cool. I tried to convince the guards to let us in into the fort. Yep. No, I understand. He told me that there's no cashier, so because it's a paint monument. It is what it is. I just wanted to take some footage. Done. Done. What did you wish for? I cannot tell you. 
Otherwise, it's not going to become true. Tell me. Nope. Maybe we can try to get there with the cake and just get some footage. Okay. 